What's going on guys, David here, and today is a good day. Why? We got a package in the mail. So, where's it at? Where's my package? Ah, here's my package. Straight from Amazon. I wonder what this could be. I know what it is. All right guys, look, I'm gonna set you all up on the tripod and uh, we'll go ahead and unbox this mystery package, okay? See you in a second. Alright guys, so let's go ahead and unbox this package. Oh, I'm excited about this one. Alright guys, what do we got here? Well, it looks to be a box inside of a box. Okay, get rid of box number one. Oh, here we go, boys and girls. Here we go. That's right. I got myself a Feu Tech G6 gimbal for the uh, GoPro. And came with a nice little tripod. Huh. Awesome. We'll get to the, uh, you know what? Let's, uh, we'll get to the uh, gimbal here in just a second. Let's go ahead and check out the side. Extender. It's a reach pole, reach pole. I'll tell you what. Okay, so. Oh, okay. Man, it feels kind of nice. I like the grip. Extends out pretty, pretty easily. I do And you can go ahead and lock it. It's pretty dang secure. All right. All right, guys. Let's get to this uh, G6 gimbal here. Don't mind the dough. Now, guys, what a gimbal is, first of all, let me explain what a gimbal is first. A gimbal is essentially, it's a three axis stabilizer, which really will smooth out your footage. Uh, so you don't have that shaky, jittery footage, um, which really help with us because I do a lot of, uh, I do a lot of car shoots and things like that. And this will really help with the, uh, with getting better shots. So let's go ahead and unbox this thing. Oh boys, I'm excited. Let's see here. So the first thing you notice, it comes in this nice case. It's a very, very nice case. I like it. Uh, seems to have plenty of protection. Nice handle. And it's really not that big. You can put this in a backpack or, or wherever you need to put it. And uh, it's really not that big of a case. So that's a good thing. Here we go. Here we go. Boom. Look at that. So let's see. What does this all come with? I like that. First impressions, guys. This case, very good. Um, I like the, it's just a pre, it just seems like a very premium product. Um, first impressions, very positive, very positive. So what do we got in here? Let's see, we got accessories. Okay guys, so we have two extra screws. 
comes with two extra screws to hold the uh, hold the action camera. It comes with this cord here, which is a micro USB to USB C. So essentially, what you do here is you plug this into the gimbal, and then you plug the USB C end into your GoPro, and you can keep your battery charged on your GoPro through the gimbal, which is a really really nice feature. And I think the gimbal lasts for up to 12 hours on battery life. If you're charging your GoPro, I think it's about 8 hours of battery life, which is still really good. Um, that's even more than I could even shoot versus memory card. So that's a really good feature. You'll never run out of battery power as you're out there trying to take your shots and everything. And of course, it comes with your charging cable, uh, micro USB, and your... USB so uh, I, I guess you can I guess you can plug this into any any charger uh, or computer I don't know I'm gonna have to read up on that it comes with your battery 26650 3.6 that comes to 26650 3.6 volt 5,000 milliamp battery that's a that's a massive battery so that's pretty good so let's go ahead and get this gimbal out here. Alrighty. Wow guys, first impressions, really solid. It's made of metal. Um, the motors seem very smooth. Uh, so I'll tell you what, since I'm filming on my GoPro, it's hard for me to put my GoPro in here and show you everything. But I'll go ahead and show you some of the features here. I'll go ahead and show you some of the features here. So, essentially what you have here, essentially what you have here is an LCD screen that gives you statuses such as battery life. Uh, the really cool thing is you can link your GoPro up to this. So, that'll give you um, pretty much like what mode you're in in the GoPro. You can also control different settings on your GoPro. Um, which uh, resolution and stuff you want to use with that so that's really nice you have your joystick which seems very smooth it's not notchy it's just a really good feel with the thumb so that's really good you have your mode button you have three different modes of course you have your pan mode you have your tilt and pan mode uh, so your pan mode pretty much if you if you turn your GoPro like this it, it'll pan this way if you turn it like that It'll pan that way and look at whatever you want to look at. With the tilt and pan, you can go this way, that way, or you can go up and down um, with it. So that's really good. And then your third mode is a hold mode. So what the hold mode does is wherever you're pointing that GoPro, wherever you move this gimbal, it's going to stay in that direction. Okay. Also, if you press this button here three times, what's going to happen is it's going to go into selfie mode which is going to turn the gimbal 360 back at you to help you with selfies and, and if you're vlogging that's really great because you can go back and talk to yourself and then go back to the action this right here this bottom button is when you are linked into your GoPro what it does is it you press this button to either record or take your pictures or stop recording uh, so that's really awesome you don't have to reach up here to control your GoPro up here you can just press it here over here is a button here as well this button here um, when you are linked to your GoPro that's how you go to your settings on your GoPro and what I'm gonna do now is I'm actually gonna go ahead and I'm gonna go ahead and pause the video and I'm gonna go ahead and take the GoPro out of the tripod I have now and we'll go ahead and put it in the gimbal and we'll see what kind of footage we go get with it okay so that's what I'm gonna do so I'll see you in a minute guys all right guys so let's see hey that worked all right guys so check it out I have the gimbal hooked up I have it hooked up through uh, the GoPro as well which is really convenient I really like it so what I'm gonna do now is I'm actually going to go out to a car meet and uh, use this gimbal and see how it does to go give you guys some test footage. All right. Ooh, that's pretty nice. First of all, this little bit of test footage here. See if we hold it. That's holding. 
If I go ahead and look at dog. There we go. I can go ahead and look at doggy 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 dog. Doggy doggy dog. Doggy dog. We got the other dog here. We got Bella. Hi Bells. That's pretty nice. So if I'm looking around, as you can see here, as I'm walking around, walking around the house here, it's very stable and whatever I look at, it looks at. So, you know, I really like this. The pain, or it's pretty much the follow feature. Excuse me, I got that wrong before the follow feature. So no matter what I look at, That's pretty cool. Test footage.